welcome to the Indie Digest. Today we are looking at an amazing game. It's completely free, it's on the internet. It is an Attack on Titan tribute game. I have to stress this is not an official game. And it clearly isn't, because if it was, it would be terrible. Because all licensed games are such a handful. This is amazing. It's not big, it's not fancy, it hasn't got much stuff in it. But god damn it, I've been playing it for hours these past few days. It is am utterly amazing. Now, for those of you who are not aware, like I was not until I actually played this game, which was quite odd, Attack on Titan is a Japanese comic slash TV show, I think. Maybe it's a movie, I'm not sure. Anyway, it is about these big things called Titans. Let me, let me show one to you. I don't... <laughs> you can see in the distance there. Now, I don't think that's entirely how they look in the show. Oh, there's one. But this is what they look like in this. So this is the basic game. Uh, I'm playing as this character. There's many characters to choose from. This one is mine. She can slash. And she also can give herself a speed boost as her special. And so I can run quite fast, and that's quite nice. Let's see, I can jump. And I can, you know, slash at them. And that's all well and good. However, these titans, they can only be killed in one way. You have to slash them in the back of the neck. Now, that's quite a tricky place to hit from down here. And that is why we have the best movement in any game ever. Grappling hooks. Oh, yeah. Took me quite a while to figure out how to use these, but we have a grappling hooks. We also have a jetpack. It's not very effective. Oh, good lord, there's a jumper. I'm on normal. You're not supposed to... Oh, God, help me. There really not supposed to be any jumpers on normal. So there's a few different types. There's crawlers, there's the slow walkers, and then there's the runny, jumping bastards that always murder me. Not sure I've ever even killed one of them. But, um... Yeah, this it's it's got grappling hooks. It's amazing. It's this basically the best Spider-Man game you'll ever see. You can you can do two at once. It's a bit tricky. I normally only do one, try and go up momentum, but yeah, to each their own. And it is just the most f fun movement out of any game ever. And it, it it's just a free game. It's amazing. It's not like a weird platform or anything. You're actually swinging about in a 3D world, and something's chasing me, isn't it? I can hear it. I can hear it. Where's me, you bastard? I'm running up a tree. Uh-oh. Ooh! <laughs> Shit. Okay, well, that didn't go particularly well. Let's see how high I can get. Use the, you use the jetpack to get a bit more speed while moving, and then it's all about... Oh, God, I've got to screw that up. Then it's all about how you use the momentum. So you get speed, and I can fling myself up. I can do better than that. Come on. Oh, hit the ground, lost all my speed. So, yeah, it's all about, um, the, the movement is all about the, um, managing your momentum and just swinging. It, it is, it is Spider-Man. It, it's not like one of those terrible Spider-Mans either that I've seen on the internets that are apparently just press a button and you swing out of midair. It, it is nothing like that. If you don't hit the tree, you don't get it. If you're not within 120 numbers of the tree you don't get it also there's other maps there's not just this one but because of how the recording is set up uh, do this is the only one you're seeing unless i really feel like doing more but the yeah you only um it, it's just amazing because it's really skillful it this took me hours Be I, originally i just i couldn't hit anything they were just munching on me all day uh, it, was, it was no damn good but i spent a bit of time and i actually it, any movement system you have to learn just to move about is good. It's good because it means just moving about in this game is supremely satisfying, which is good because killing them would be more satisfying, but I can't really do it. I mean, I'll give it a go. There's, there should be one I'm about to drop down on. Uh, well, missed him by quite a bit. Okay, yeah, you can grapple to them. At least you can if you hit them. And you have to get behind them. Oh, got him in the eye. Uh, uh, don't eat me, don't eat me, don't eat me. Oh, 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 come on, come on, come on. Back of the neck, back of the neck. Yes. Hitbox is a little awkward, but it's supposed to be. If it was easy, the 
There's no point. Oh no, he's gonna beat me. He's gonna beat me. He's gonna beat me. He's gonna beat me. Who? Nah, you don't. Okay, hook and grapple. Ooh, dodge the thing. Dodge the thing. Okay, I've got to get out of here. There's two of them. There is a dodge person. Oh no. No, 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 no. Hello? Yeah. So, yeah. It, it, it's pretty much an insta kill. And almost anything they do is insta kill. Just, you know, throwing that out there. It's a difficult game. It's really difficult. The only thing you have to do is defeat 15 of them in one go. That's basically it. Unless you're on one of the harder maps, in which case you have to beat 30 of them in one go. Uh, that doesn't tend to happen. In fact, I've never beaten this. I can sometimes kill maybe five before the. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Don't get close to the mouth. Just munch you straight out of the air. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, nearly, nearly. Oh, uh, they grabbed me. They grabbed me. Yep, they're dead. It's. <laughs> it's so fun. It's just so fun. Everybody needs to play this. The link's in the description. Should be, anyway. It, it just just go 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 play it. It's Unity. It'll run on anything. It's it's amazing. Just I mean, we could talk about the other things. We could talk about the graphics. You know, it's Unity. It's um, it's indie. It's free. You can't expect the world. Though frankly, this is. I mean, right, if you ignore the, the weird sort of tree texture, the actual character models are rather good. I don't know how accurate they are to the characters in the comic show. What have you? But I have to imagine they're close enough. I don't think the Titans are close, unless... I've only seen, like, one image of Attack on Titans, and the Titans red to start with, so... I don't know if that's actually a typical one, or maybe that's, like, a special one, but... Yeah, it doesn't really... Th these don't really look like that, unless... Unless they're trying to avoid copyright, but frankly, they called it Attack on Titans Tribute, so... They're, 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 they're wearing their influence as a mask on their face. It's not even... You know, you know, it's not, any, not even as far down as a sleeve. It is straight up, this is what they want to do. And I suppose, theoretically, if they ever wanted to sell it in any form, if they've added to it maybe a bit, then they could theoretically just take off the name Attack on Titan and say miscellaneous um, grappling hook sword game. Maybe, I'm not really sure. Anyway, where's my curse gone? Yes, that's something I should talk about. Uh, quickly, sound, barely any. The, the, the things stomp around and there's a slash and that's all. You do have to notice, though, there are three different methods of camera style in this game. Presently, I'm using what they refer to as original. I believe that means that it, it is the one they created originally for this game. And it works quite well. The basic way it works is the curse is in the middle, giving you a bit of free roam, but if you move it further to the side, it spins around quite nice, quite simple, quite effective because it lets you aim while still uh, having a, uh, the same direction. That's very good for one, one very good reason. When you when you swing in a tree, when you grapple a tree, it used to be that I would just go straight into it, and that that just kills your momentum. That's no good. So what you have to do is you have to strafe like left or right, while we sort of have to pick a direction to be moving. Well, oh god, I'm not demonstrating this very well. There we go, while moving, in order to not be pulled straight into the tree. But to do that, and then continue to um, get the others, what you really have to do is be able to then pick one while you're still going in a certain direction. Which is much easier when it doesn't immediately turn you, as in this one. This is the traditional third-person action game view, which is your character perfectly follows the cursor. Now, you can swing around quite well in this mode the, quite well it's not it's not a preferred one it's the one i started with because I, I find it quite an easy one to start with and it, it is quite nice to see the camera sort of move about it's got a very good feel to the whole uh, the whole swinging about i find it quite difficult to do the combat however i will um attempt to demonstrate let's ha have a straight up fight with this one We'll also demonstrate the lock-on. There is a, a lock-on. I don't use it that often. I probably should use it a lot more, but yeah, just details. Over here, dude. Over here. So there we go. Now, the lock-on works terribly in the third person. You, you just can't do it because it locks onto the belly button, and you can't hit him from there. So to lock-on, you basically have to be in the in the original view. This uh, Yeah. Because then it still locks on, and so it's all... Make sure to always send to you, but you can aim where you want to hook, which is very important if you're going to climb up them, which you are going to do because that's what you have to do, honestly. 
Oop, turn around. Come on, come on, come on, let me kill one. Let me, don't. You don't want to get stuck on under the... I mean, classic ways to die, getting stuck under the belly button, getting stuck under the nipples. Oh no! Somebody turned up. It, it's just bad ways to die. But yeah, you can swing around in the third person view very well. It's just combat's a bit awkward and certainly lock-on is impossible to use effectively. So, you know, just to, just throwing it out there. If you want to use the lock-on ability, you can't use third person, otherwise it ain't going to work for you. The third one I have not used so much because it's... I haven't found a way it's better in any way yet. Maybe there's something I'm missing. It is the... Let me just get somewhere safe. This is not safe. There's giant stompy people everywhere. Uh, the third one is referred to as the... Oh god, there's a crawler over there. Is referred to as the WoW view. And that is because it is the view of the game World of Warcraft. Uh, this one. Move the thing, the, the, the cursor, and the character just stays. You have to hold right click in order to turn. Uh, incidentally, I should point out, I have rebound a couple of... Oh, God. I have rebound a couple of um, controls, specifically the grappling hooks to left and right mouse button as opposed to Q and E, because, frankly, you're using the swings a lot... Well, I'm using the swings a lot more than um, the attack. Maybe I should be attacking constantly, but I just prefer to swing around everywhere because that's more fun than fighting. Um, but yeah, this 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 view is not very helpful. Yeah, it's just too restrained. You have to yeah you have to move the thing to to, to turn. It it just no 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 no. I I don't care for it at all. Third person or original for me. Maybe some people are just so into WoW they absolutely have to have that view in any other game. If you're that person, you have frankly played too much WoW, so yeah. But that pretty much covers it, I should think. To sum it up, amazing game. And you should play it. However, yeah, we can play a bit longer. And specifically, we can play what I refer to as survival mode. Bear with me one moment. Does this look roughly the same as it was, except the fact I'm this other character that has this sort of weird spinny attack? Well, it should because it is. Except for the fact that I put it into what is referred to as abnormal difficulty. Let's put it in the third person view just because... Wait, why isn't the view working there? Is the, there's the view working? Yeah? No, yeah. Um. Now basically what a normal does, it takes off all those nice easy ones and makes them all really goddamn difficult. They're all fast, they're all jumping, they're all there's a load of crawling ones, and it just makes this game ridiculously hard. Look at that! Look at, look at him coming for me. That's ridiculous. That's just utterly ridiculous. I mean that's just unfair, quite frankly. Look, look at that. This, 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 no, no, oh god, no, 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 oh dear, <laughs> hey. That bloody jaws. Really, dude? Really? This, I mean, I have killed one, maybe, maybe two titans in this mode before. It's not really what I do, though. I just prefer to turn it onto this mode and see how long I can survive. I think, realistically, my best time has been about two minutes. Unless I've gone into a corner and somehow none of them have seen me, which has happened just not very often. This this is ridiculous fun. It, it just is. It's, oh my god. Oh, no, no, I, I hooked him. I shouldn't have done that. Woo. Hey. Let's try, dude. Yeah, don't, if, if you're first time playing, don't put it on this mode. You will not get anywhere. You need a bit of, you need to take a bit of time to learn the movement controls. But if you have played the other one for a bit of time, maybe even killed a couple of titans, yeah, give this a go. It's good, it's good practice of your, oh my god. Woo, that's it. Hey, nearly, very nearly got me there. Ah, if you can't keep moving, you will die. It is that simple. If you stand still too long, they will track you down. They will eat you. Doesn't matter how high you are. Doesn't matter how far away you are. One of them will turn up. Height isn't perfect either, because apparently they can just jump at you. You can also try and juke them. Just stay near trees. Maybe use them to block. Not perfect, though. Alternatively, you can just try and fight them straight up. Sometimes that 
can work. Is that a mini one? Let's go find a mini one. I say mini is probably still three times the size of me. Oh, there's others coming for me. Oh, we're more than 120 away from the tree. No. <laughs> it <did>. That's... <laughs> it, it's, it's ridiculous. I love it. I love everything about this game. Seriously, if they ever decide to sell this in any form, I'm like, day one, brilliant, buying it. I want it. I, I want to give them money. I want, I want to give these people money F for something. I don't, I don't generally do donations. Maybe they have it, though. Maybe you should do it. Maybe you have the money to do it. Um... <laughs> Okay, it's good. I need to wrap this up, otherwise I will never, never stop, because I, I just won't. I can do this for hours, just constantly swinging about, and oh my god, it's so fun. Seriously, it's fun. Um, right, so this has been Attack on Titans, and I think that is it. Oh, and you can play as a Titan.